What is grounding? Well, perhaps it's easier to explain by using the analogy of an oak tree. Imagine a grand old oak tree that stood for many years. It goes through all kinds of different weathers. The heat of summers, storms, frost. But no matter what is happening at the level of its branches, its trunk and roots remain firmly planted in the ground. And if you were in that oak tree, high up in the branches, and then suddenly a storm appeared and began to shake the branches, you'd be clinging on, fearful that you'd fall. And what you'd probably do is get down to the ground as quickly as you could. Now this wouldn't make the storm stop, but it would be the safest place for you to be, provided there wasn't any lightning, to wait until the storm passed. So in this way, we can ground ourselves by paying attention to the breath or the body or our environment to bring a sense of centering, of inner balance, even though there may be an emotional storm happening around us. And if you like this analogy, there is an oak tree imagery practice together with a five to one relaxation practice further on in the course. But for now, I invite you, wherever you are sitting or resting, to just acknowledge that perhaps there are some difficult things happening Perhaps the mind is busy, perhaps the body is feeling tense. We're just acknowledging that without trying to change it. And at the same time, I want you to bring your fingertips together and just feel those fingertips press into each other. At the same time, I want you to press your feet into the floor as I'm doing or your heels into the bed if you're not on a chair and sit up alert and begin to just move your arms and we're going to acknowledge again that there are some difficult things here right now and at the same time we can move our bodies and actually I can stretch so even though there are difficult things I can move my body, can move my legs. And at the same time, as I'm moving my body, as I'm acknowledging that there are difficult, painful things here that I didn't ask for and I certainly don't want, I'm going to look for five things I can see. And I'm going to acknowledge that right now I'm sitting here. There are difficult things. I can move my body. I can feel my breath. And I can look around me. 